Hi, this is Craig Cameron with Mobile Monkey. Today we're going to go over the Mobile Monkey dashboard. We're going to show you all the cool features it has and how to navigate around it so you can build a better bot. Let's get started. This is the main dashboard that you are going to see. This is going to show you your company and if you hit this drop down there will be other companies listed in there for other pages that other companies if you have clients that have that you're building bots for they'll give you access to their pages and then their company will show up here so if you change to a different company then just their pages will show up and then you'll be able to manage their bot and see all their dashboards so each company has its own dashboard and the next thing here is this is where you connect pages so under your company you can have as many pages as you want and if you hit connect pages it's going to give you a list of every page that you're an admin of and to add one of those pages you just select the checkbox and then it will add it over here then clicking on any of these pages will give you the dashboard of that page. Each page as you click on it you'll see that the page information is up here and this if you click this link it will go to the actual fan page and then this is just a quick summary of your contacts, the contacts this week and the sessions. Now this little gear if you click on that you're gonna have some other options one is uh, your Facebook ad so if you hit this it's gonna show your ads account and you can connect to your ads account and you can use that later in Facebook Messenger ads here's all the users that you've given access to your pages and then this little thing right here is refresh connection to Facebook sometimes the connection gets lost and your bot you know isn't working correctly you can come here and refresh the connection and you'll be good. Here's where you disconnect the Facebook page. So if it's just a page that you're not using anymore, you can click that and disconnect it. And then here's where you can transfer bots to other companies. So if you have other companies listed, which are other clients, you can actually build a page in one company and then transfer it through this setting here. Now the next thing is over here if you hit your profile and you click on settings you're gonna have your billing information and then if you click on users you'll see all your users and if you edit any of these users you're able to select different options for them. Select certain pages if you let me go to this one here so you have page collaborator you have admin if you want to give someone admin they'll be able to do everything collaborator they'll be able to manage all your pages but they won't be able to like disconnect or reconnect a page and then Facebook page collaborator you're able to just select what page they have access to and then if you want to invite someone to your page or have your client invite you to their page just have them go into the profile and the settings and click invite user choose which option they want you to be and then copy this code and send it to you once you click on that code it's going to add the company name in the drop down and then you're going to have access to their page their page will show up here when you choose when you uh, choose the right company their page will show up here now here is where you enter the chatbot builder so once you're ready to actually start adding dialogues and um, content and conversations and then here's just a little bit of information how many chat blasts you've sent the different audiences you have your click to messenger ads you'll have summaries and then you can click on any of these and it'll take you right in there and then this little drop down right here is where all your bots will be because you can have multiple bots on a page you can just only have one active at a time so if you want to create a new bot you just hit create new bot and then you name the bot here and then you have three options you can build your bot from scratch 
You can start from one of our existing templates by choosing any of these, or you can copy an existing bot. So if you've created a bot on another page inside your account, you're able to copy that. It'll make a complete duplicate, and then you're able to go back in and edit it and do what you need to do with it. All right, so that's a brief overview of our dashboard. If you have any questions, send us a message in our group or send an email to support at mobilemonkey.com. Hope that helps.